Hello everybody and uh, Labdiena once again. Um, so today I thought I would do a video on maybe some interesting facts about Lithuania. So I'm going to do 10 interesting facts on Lithuania. Hopefully you don't know them. If you're Lithuanian you might know most of them but there might be a couple that you don't know. Um, and if you're not from Lithuania well Hopefully this gives you some information on the country. So I hope you like it. And if you have any interesting facts yourself, just leave them in the comments below. Okay, so first fact about Lithuania that you may not know is that Lithuania is supposedly the, the center of Europe, geographically speaking. Um, so the exact central point of Europe is meant to be kind of near to a village called Pernuskas, which is like 25 kilometers away from the capital, Vilnius. Okay, my second interesting fact about Lithuania is about the language. So Lithuanian is one of the oldest languages in the world. And it's actually closely related to ancient Sanskrit. Okay, so for the third interesting fact about Lithuania, actually one of my favorite things about this country is it's covered by a third well a third of the country is covered in forest I was saying. so yeah there's no mountains here but plenty of forest okay so on to the fourth fact now and this one is probably something that a lot of people wouldn't know so um for you kind of i don't know what you call it horror horror fans um anyone who likes silence of the lambs anyway um, one of the main characters is actually from Lithuania and I bet you can't guess which one it is. Well, it is in fact Hannibal Lecter, the, uh, the serial killer. Yes, um, Hannibal Lecter was apparently born into a Lithuanian family uh, where he lived uh, as an orphan, I believe. Um, so yeah, Hannibal Lecter is actually Lithuanian. Okay, now it's number five. So, apparently, Lithuania was the last European nation to convert to Christianity. Okay, so we're on to point number, well, interesting fact, number six, should I say. And um, this time, it's that, well, the national bird of Lithuania is the stork. And I, I guess I can attest to this because I have seen quite a lot especially out in the in the countryside here um i've seen plenty of storks but there's apparently 13,000 breeding pairs of storks and if you do come to lithuania i'm sure you'd be able to spot some of their nests along the along the kind of country roads on the electricity pylons and things like that so interesting fact number seven is that once upon a time lithuania was actually the biggest country in europe um in the 14th century, I believe. Uh, the Grand Duchy of Lithuania had, well, the territory encompassed um, obviously in modern day Lithuania, um, Belarus, Ukraine, as well as parts of Poland and Russia. So we're on to number eight now, and this one's about the EU. So, as many of you are probably aware, Lithuania is in the EU. Um, but it formally joined the EU in 2004 and didn't adopt the Euro until 1st of January 2015. Okay, and now, well, it's got a little bit darker here, but um, my interesting fact, uh, my number nine on the list is that unlike kind of most European nations, I guess, um, the national sport in Lithuania is not football. It's um, actually basketball. Um, and to be honest, when you come out here, it's not really a surprise as everyone is pretty tall. <laughs> so yeah, um, the actual national sport of Lithuania is basketball and not football. And final fact of the day, number 10. Well, that is that Lithuania was the first um, state 
in the Soviet Union to declare independence. I believe this was in 1990 when Lithuania declared independence. Uh, March of 1990, I think.